Good day, Ranger Guild, and welcome back to HDL Season 2. Um, this is up against Epic Mick and the Colo uh, Colorado uh, Rock Ruffs. And what's really great is that we are already clinched for playoff um, due to how the rest of our division has played. Um, we're in a position where no matter what, we're going on to playoffs. So in the way this like this battle next week's battle don't really matter. Um, but we are up against Epic Mick, who needs to win this in order to like kind of guarantee or have a good shot at playoffs. Um, so I'm not going to hold back, even though we are good friends. Uh, we are still going to try our best and just have a fun, good, clean battle. Um, as you guys can see, we are bringing Drachi, Mega Gardevoir, Staraptor, um, Vaporeon, Incineroar, and Miltank. And we think he's going to be bringing his Mega Venusaur, Clefable, Lucario. Uh, Kafgriga, Starmie, and um, Swellow. So we're going to jump in, see what he's got actually, and get right into it. Oh, some interesting things. All right, Thunders. <laughs> That's fine. Um, so a lot of things which... Um, he didn't actually bring, which I'm kind of surprised, but at the same time, I kind of fine with. Um, let's do ramp damage. I honestly didn't think he was going to bring Rapidash. Oh, that is the wrong Pokemon. That's for my team. All right, so no Mega Venusaur, which is kind of surprising to me. At the same time, it's kind of nice. Um, and yeah, so this is gonna be super interesting. Um, rocks on both sides are going to be up. <laughs> um, that's what I'm kind of feeling. So, no Mega Venusaur, we got Rapdash instead. Um, no Coffer Grigas, and instead we got Thunderous. So we got nice little Thunderous. And no Starmie, instead we got um, Palpatode. No, not Palpatode. Seismitoad. Oh, Frogger boy. Unfortunately, we have no grass moves on our entire team. <laughs> um, and not Swellow, and so we got Kirin. So, several things which. I was not expecting him to bring, um, but I'm not really that worried about at the same time. Because we have like a fair amount of stuff for all of them. Um, so some things that I'm gonna have to be careful on is items on <laughs> Rapidash, uh, Lucario, Thunderous, and Kirim. Um, possibly also Seismitoad. Like, all of those could have Choice Scarfs, um, which could be, like, super scary. Um, so, I kind of... How does Rapidash... How are you looking? Whew, you do so much damage. <laughs> um... Yeah, Fire MZ just obliterates. Um, psychic. So, I feel Thunderous. I 
Unfortunately, like Jirachi is going to be kind of hard set for Rocks in this game. Is what I am uh, I'm seeing. Um, if you have Dark Pulse, because you like to bring that, it does relatively nothing. Good to know. Okay. Um, Science Toad. And now you're going to have. So that's two shot. So, what's in, hmm. I think what I want to do is, I think I want to leave Incineroar and then pivot from there. As lead size, but uh, that's fine. Um, so we're gonna get the Intimidate. He could have Swiss Swim, Poison Touch, or War Absorb. And I think I am just going to U turn into. Um, into my uh, Melt Tank. And I can go for Toxic, I can go for. Stealth rocks. Yep, okay. So he does have rock helmet. That was another thing that I kind of. Ooh, earth power. Okay. So here, I kind of want to get a toxic off. And, you know, he could switch into Lucario, obviously. It's funny if he does. I can, like, switch around with my Vaporeon and whatnot. Um, the other thing I have to worry about is possibly like a Z solar beam from Rapidash. <laughs> Alright, let's me get the toxic off and stealth rocks are up. That's fine. Um, that is fine. Though, obviously, in Sinroar, not gonna have that many switch ins now. Um, I think here. I'm just gonna go for a buy slam, um, just in case he wants to go into his uh, Lucario. But he says then that's fine. Yeah, he goes for Toxic, that's fine. Um, I'm just gonna go for the Heal Bell this turn, and then next turn I can like go for Milk Drink. <laughs> of course he burns me. <laughs> Uh, yeah, Moe Drink into Heal Ball. Alright, he goes to Kari. That's fine. Because this is going to let me check see what he is. Yeah, so I'm just going to go into my Vaporeon and check to see what he is. Alright, okay, Sword Stance, that's fine. I'm going to Scald here because I need to break a potential Focus Sash. So if he's not life orb, he's he doesn't have a chance to knock me out. Um, if he does, if he is life orb, um, he has a good chance to. But same time, I now know he is not. Um, he's not scarf, so my garbor will be faster than him. So I just need to get a little bit of damage off and then go from there. All right, that's fine. I don't really care that he did that. Um, I am gonna go for the protect here because he, yep, goes for toxic. So I have some choices here. Um, 
Obviously, he's not going to go for Scald. Um, he could go for Earthquake, Projecting. Um, my draw should come in. Um, so, how, how much did... So, let's check what his, like, damage is. Uh, with Scald. Yeah, so... Earth power, and then let's do Jirachi. Ooh, <laughs> thanks so much from Earth power. Eh, I don't appreciate. Um, so I need to keep my uh, my Vaporeon nice and healthy. Um, So I think I'm going to go I think I'm going to go Miltank just on the switch. He might go for Toxic again. He goes for Earth Power. That's what I was kind of worried about um, and why I did that. I'm going to go for the Milk Drink this turn. Because once again, um, the biggest concern I have is just making sure that I break the Lucario's Focus Sash. If he has one, which I'm expecting him to have. Unless he really messed up and uh, was Choice Scarf um, Sword Stance. But even if he goes... Um, Oh, we got thunders. Interesting. Um, thunders. If you sub, can I break it? Question is. No, I can't. Good to know. Um, I'm gonna heal bell. <gasps> He taunted me, that monster. Um, I mean, that's fine. If I had to bring in Jirachi, I, I don't want to really, but if I did, yeah, Flying Bolt does a lot. But good to know that um, he's not Scarf. Um, I'm just going to buy Slam here. Oh, that does so much damage. Is that Magnet? You have to be like Magnet. Right? Or Modest. Might be Modest. Sixty percent. That does so much. What? Is he magnet modest? What is going on here? Um. Yeah. So unfortunately, Mel Tank just gonna go down here. And here, I think Guardboard just comes in. No. I think I'm the Yeah, I should I should have done that. I forgot totally forgot about Trace, which is really bad on my part. Um So Guard War. If you are regular, um how much do you take from a Dark Pulse? Not much. So I think I'm going to stay regular and go for the Psychic. Because <laughs> this will force him... Um, 
Because if you stay in, um, his best attack to hit me would be Thunderbolt. But yeah. Um, to be fair, Milta Inc. kind of did his job. Um, it wasn't really going to do much. Um, it was mainly also here for the uh, Mega Venusaur. If I was running Thick Fat, I would have wanted to kind of think about it more and kind of keep it around. It goes to Glyph Fable. That's fine. It is 41%. So, clef, 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 clef. Um, so, how, wait, what? How did I do that much damage? You like, no. Oh no, this is Psy Shock, not Psychic. So that did. So it seems like it's that. Um, Tanya. Hyper voice. Good chance to knock him out now. So we're going to do that. Which unfortunately um, gets rid of my <laughs> Thunderbolt switching, but that's fine. My problem is I really want rocks up. <laughs> My issue is I'm really not going to get them up. So my main issue at the moment is one of two things. Um, either I need to get, well, preferably I need to get rid of um, Thunderous, because if I can get rid of Thunderous, then I can click Braybird on all of his Pokemon, and it's going to do a lot of damage. Um, I also need Thunderous gone, so Vaporeon can kind of uh, help the just wall the rest of his team. So, this is a big, like, what does Mick do next kind of thing. It's tough. Um, I do. If I rock, like, I really want to. I was really, like, contemplating just leading Drachi and getting rocks up. Um, I feel like that would have made this battle a lot easier. Um, because I'm, like, almost 100% guarantee or, like, sure that. Uh, Lucario's has uh, Focus Sash. Um, and if I had gotten those up early, then we would have been gained, you know, 25% off on uh, Kyurem, 25% off on uh, Rapid Ash, 25 on Thunderous. Um, so, okay, he goes Rapid Ash. Honestly, I'm probably just going to go Incineroar. Um, I know I am taking rock damage. I don't really need Incineroar um, for the rest of his team. So gain the minus one and then threatening with a uh, knockoff slash taunt will be nice. The main thing is I just need, I want to get Drachi in for rocks. Um, if I can do that, then I may have a good chance of 
busting through his team. Um, by the way, you're modest. Yeah, easy moved. Pfft, did nothing. <laughs> Alright. Um, you know, here would be nice if I had Darkest Lariat. Because, um, you know, he has Z Crystal, so. Unfortunateness. Um, do I want damage or do. So, if Inferno Overdrive did damage to damage, I'm most likely not going to be able to come in on rocks again. Um. And I'm pretty sure if I, yeah, if I go down the rocks, I won't get intimidate. Um, but it could be a free sack for something. So it might be useful. Um, let me check see if he was admin or jolly. Uh, So that did 29%, looking like jolly. Yeah, it was, either, it was either a very low roll on the admin or what you'd expect for jolly. So minus one, Jirachi. Um, oh jeez, Flare Blood's still like, Oh no, it's not showing the minus one. Um, yeah, so I think I just let him go down. Um, stomping tantrum. Yeah, so I think I just get damage off with flare blitz, or knock off, I should say. Ooh, it still does so much damage. Um. Yeah, so that's pretty nice. Um, just gonna knock off again. Oh, he's Morning Sun. I'm doing more damage than he's healing, and I'm healing, so I'm not sure why he's doing that. So, this is pretty decent for me. Um, I can just Flare Blitz here. Yeah, that's fine. Um, here I'm just going to go to my Jirachi and I'm going to get up Stealth Rocks. <laughs> that is the plan. Hopefully he does not um, Thunderbolt paralyze me or Dark Pulse flinch me. Okay, good. Stealth rocks, fine. It's good. That's that's very good. And here, just go for the iron head. It's fine. And we're gonna go guard war, and we're gonna click hype voice. Six percent. That's fine. Knocks him out. Good. That's fine. We're going to go to Vaporeon now. Yep. Ball punch. To be expected, um, you're going to wish. As you go to Seismic Toad, it's fine. Goodbye, Seismic Toad. Um. I'm just going to protect. Ox mount, good. And here, let's see how much. Okay. Um, it's the Raptor. How much do you uh, Lucario? Uh, I'm 
So 88 to guarantee Bray Bird uh, close combat knocks it out. So I'm just going to roar. Yep, he substitutes. Sorry, buddy. No. Um, and here I can just go for Scald. I'm the roar. I'm not going to let him set up with a sword stance. Like, honestly, I just want him to take out my Vaporeon at this point. Uh, how much does Bolt Punch do? Yeah, it does practically nothing. Even if you're adamant. So, I think we do have this in the game now. Uh, pretty much it's just going to come down to... Us, um, hmm. so keep him. I really, I really now I wish I had baton pass right now. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah. So let's go for the Scald this turn, because I think he's going to stay in. Yep, yeah, goes for Zen Headbutt, okay. Yep, yeah, Scald does a lot of damage. And Vaporeon might take up, might pick up these last uh, couple kills. Definitely with that, um, well. Oh. And leftovers, so we're gonna give the last kill to our Gardevoir with a nice little hyper voice. And good game to Mick. It was super close, um, you know, bringing down to 2-0. Um, super scared, um, you know, rocks early hurt me a lot. Um, but it was excellent game to Mick. I really look forward to um, seeing how he does. Um, hopefully, you know, he'll be able to make it off into playoffs, but, you know, it all depends on how the other battles go and whatnot. But great game to Mick. Um, awesome job. You have definitely improved a lot more as a battler, and I am really proud of you. So keep up the great work, and I'm looking forward to seeing you in another battle slash playoff soon.